Okay, so we're here with Drummer Boy uh, here in Atlanta in the studios. Uh, you work with so many different artists. Like we said, the range, um, the resume, the production credits is, is very long. Mm -hmm. um, now, I was hearing that you were trying to, uh, are you working currently with some artists on the, the UK hip hop scene as well? Yeah, we're doing a lot of, uh, we're doing this global competition with New School Rules, you know what okay. I mean? Shout out to Henka, my girl, you know what I'm saying? Um, uh, we basically put together this competition where we, you know, anybody around the world can sign up. You can go to www.newschoolrules.com. Okay. School spelled with a K. So okay. it's S K O O L. Um, go to the site, click on Drummer Boy, you know what I'm saying? You can register with me. And uh, I think it's like 45 euros to, okay. uh, to sign up, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you get to submit a MP3 and a visual or YouTube link or just any kind of footage of you performing your record, your song, performance, whatever, and um, you get a chance to work in the studio with me. Six days we go in the studio, work on a demo. Seventh day you get an opportunity to shop your demo throughout the United States. Wow. Connections that we have, you know what I mean? So it's, it's, it's going to be a big deal, you know what I mean? And definitely okay. I'm going in on the production and we're trying <laughs> to put together like a great demo. The people that we've been uh, having submit so far and that we've been just going through the auditions have been crazy, like the talent. Okay. It's, it's like I got to work with one person, but okay. just through the submissions I see about five or maybe ten more people that I want to work with outside of the competition. I got you. I so, got you know, you. It's, it's, it's a good way to see who's, you know, see who's who. Right. From Australia, from London, from, you know what I'm saying, the Netherlands, from Russia, from, right, right. you know, Africa, South Africa. America, you know what I'm saying? There's I got people you. all around the world, you know what I mean? California, Chicago, you know. And will mean? they be coming here to the? Uh, they'll be coming yeah, here to the U.S. Come and work with me oh, in, wow. in Atlanta. So you know wow. what I'm saying? So definitely, they get a trip to the United States. You know what I mean? If they're from, you know, outside of the United States, of course, and uh, wherever you're from, you come to the ATL, baby. You, <laughs> you know what I mean? So check it out: www.newschoolrules.com. Okay, we definitely gonna put that up on the site and everything. So. Um, you know, looking at that from an international connection, I know that, uh, you know, it's one thing uh, hearing some accolades here in the States. How, how has that been kind of received kind of cool, like you said, having people reaching yeah. out? I mean, uh, it's a blessing, man. You know, people hitting me up from Brazil a lot lately, you know what I'm saying, from everywhere, man. We just getting a lot of love. Russia, Germany, you know what I mean? Just, you know, I always I always shout this thing out called Memphis World Runners, you know what I mean? It's okay. From Memphis, you know what I mean? And we running the world, you know what I mean? And I don't mean running the world like I'm in control of the world. <laughs> exactly. I mean, running like in my journey. Right, right, so, right, right. You know, it's fun, you know what I'm saying? Different countries that I travel to, different people that I meet. And, and, and just picking up supporters around the globe is always yeah. a blessing, man. You know what I mean? Especially right. to move a masses of people through a music that I believe in. Right, right, right. It's priceless. Well, that's a cool thing, too. I'm, I'm liking the fact that, you know, so often people want to box you in and everything. Or some people people want to just, you know, say, okay, this guy's a certain kind of producer. Right. Like when I asked you about your inspirations, the first thing you were saying is Beethoven and things like that, you know? Right. And, and I think that um, that's cool. I think that. That translates throughout the world. Mm -hmm. You know, if, you, if you're passionate about your music and if you're very precise about your music, and I think that's something, is that something that you find that you're meeting people where they're producing rock records, where they're producing a rap or hip-hop or R&B, if you can relate to them on a music standpoint, mm -hmm. talking about certain things, that gets things talking. Am I correct? Or? Oh, definitely. You know what I mean? It's, 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 it's all about just getting a win, getting a, 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 a sniff. Like, you know what I mean? Even if you don't get the whole picture, you could just peep through a door you know how you peep through the corner of the door you know what I'm saying <laughs> and it makes you wonder what's inside the room even more I got you as opposed to if the door was wide open and you just pass by like oh, okay right you know right saying? but right. if that door was just cracked you know what I'm saying especially and it might be you know somebody changing the clothes or doing nothing you go <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right, so right, it's right. It's always right. that curiosity that makes people want more, and that's what I tell people. Like a lot of people want to feed people so many, so much information. Like let's say you approach me or you see me on the street, right, you right. Want to holler, drum boy, da 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 da. All right, the people that I remember are the people that are short, simple, and efficient. I got gotcha. you. Accurate, like okay, man, this dude. Yo, my name is such and such. This is what it is. This is my music. I respect what you're doing, drum boy. Keep doing it. Keep it moving, all right, right, right. You got right. your number, your card, all of that. You don't have to tell me all the information. So you cut off four or five <laughs> minutes of talking time. <laughs> right, right, right. You had your shit together. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I got so you. it's a lot of people that, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, keep it moving. You know? Right, right, definitely. Because, man, it's, it's so many things that 
people are thinking about, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, just always make somebody want more, you know what I'm saying? Make me wonder about you. Right, right, right. Yeah, who was that kid, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, but make sure it's presented professionally and things like that. Exactly. As well. And, you know. Exactly. And the same thing, like you said, like just with me, how I do it, you know, I might go in the studio and say it's, you know, two and three A&Rs from different labels, you know what I'm saying? It's a couple artists in the room, you know what I mean? Right. All the homies, you know what I mean? I know it's ears wide <laughs> open. So I might go in the room, play like two or three bangers, you know what I'm saying? Right, right, and right. And just fall back. I gotcha. I ain't got to go in the room and play, man. 50 beats, you know what I'm saying, and make people just, right, you know right. okay, now we getting tired of hearing, you know what I'm saying, like exactly. our ears hurting, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. Like you overdo it, you know what I'm saying, don't exactly. overindulge, man, keep it short and simple. Well, that's a beautiful thing also, too, I mean, I, one last thing I was just saying, it's, it's so funny, because uh, you being from Memphis, and how you're able to work with all these different artists, I, I had a chance to meet um, a brother named S1, he worked, he did some production work with Kanye West, he actually mm -hmm. uh, did uh, the power track. Mm -hmm. and whatnot and once again you know he's from dallas and whatnot it just it seems like sometimes having those being from cities like that from a dallas from a memphis you, you don't lose that grind right yeah uh, you don't lose that hustle and yeah, i mean that's what that's where we come from you know what i mean like like in, in cities like that we have to travel we have to go outside of the city because you know if we stay in the city you, you ain't gonna get you know what i'm saying all right, right like we we getting money from the city but it's like it ain't enough it ain't sufficient you know what i'm saying <laughs> right right so, so you got to keep we, it moving we, we, you know what i'm saying as in anybody you look at any of the of of you know the most elite or or you know the richest people in the world it's the ones who travel the most you know what right I'm right 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 keeping it moving yeah definitely. so so what's what's next for drum boy any any other big projects or anything particularly you want to talk uh, about i'm working on mary j blige project working on marcia from floor tree you know what wow, i'm saying okay. working on guapale we're working on uh um tiana taylor we're working on angie stone we're working on um um keisha cole you know what i'm saying we're just definitely trying to get some ladies on the wall i got a lot of men plaques on the wall <laughs> trying, to, trying to catch my ladies up you know what i got saying? you so i got you hard you know what i mean r&b uh, definitely shooting for some number ones in the R&B. Got to right, right. number ones in the rap. You know what I mean? Right, right. Once we lock R&B down, we got pop, we got country, we got you know jazz. You know, I got a couple different avenues, a couple different projects yeah. that I got planned, man. Jeezy TM 103 coming soon. Okay. You know what I'm saying definitely been a huge part of that project. You know right, what I'm right, so right. I look forward. Um, stay tuned, man. Drummer Boy Live. You know what I'm saying? The Drum Squad Movement. Right, right. You know what I'm right. saying? I got a project, a uh, mixtape drop at the top of the year. Okay, you know what I'm okay. Saying? 2011. So, stay tuned. Yeah, beautiful thing. And I, one, last one thing I want to say also is that I see that you're, you're making the moves. Uh, uh, I made reference, uh, you were on the uh, Red Housewives of Atlanta show helping uh, Candy doing a mm -hmm. production. Yeah, I produced a, pro, uh, a song for Candy called Fly Above. Okay. And I also did a song for her called Trade Them In featuring Gucci. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's the big homie Gucci, man. Shout out to Gucci, you know what I'm saying? The whole Bree Squad. Right. You know what I'm saying? We just did a Dirty Birds project. That's another project we just uh, wrapped up, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. The no Hands record. Watch yeah, I was going to say, that, that thing is just burn, it's right now, burning you know the airwaves up and everything. Wale, shout out to Wale. Shout out yeah. to uh, uh, Roscoe, you know what I'm saying? I got some right. music with Roscoe coming soon, too. So. so, man, you stay tuned, man. I got about, you know, 100,000 records coming out, man. <laughs> Well, that, I definitely appreciate Appreciate your time. You're checking us out with eardrumcrushes.com. Yes, I'm definitely going to post all of your websites and information on there and your Twitter information as well. And once again, like I said, we're going to just keep tuned and yes, uh, enjoy this ride. Eardcrushes.com. Your boy Drummer. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Thank you there, man. Yeah.